I do indeed, Danny. We were just saying that's the first time I had a Harriers goal scorer and listened to a goal scored by me. So, um, it, was a, it was a great game, wasn't it? Yeah, it was a um, great atmosphere to play in. Um, when uh, Bristol Rovers sco- uh, conceded at the end, the Barnett fans went crazy as well. So, um, yeah, that was a great game to play in, end to end stuff. And um, obviously, hopefully, there will be plenty more of that next season here um, at, at the Agbro. And, um, it's a bit of positivity for all the fans to look forward to now for next season, I feel, and um, we'll see how, 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 who's here and where they go with that. I suppose that leads to the next question into you, Danny, as I know next week is easily away as the last one. A number of Harriers players today probably playing in front of the Harriers fans for, for the last time. Do you consider yourself to be one of those in that? Yeah, well, my contract's up, so that's a big possibility. Um, I'm sure the, the gaffers either looking towards next season or you'll start to look towards next season from now. Um, but it's good to go out, for, give the home support a bit, something to, to cheer about for next season. Obviously it's been a bit disappointing in the last few months. Um, we've had a few performances, but I think too few and far between. Um, but no, today was a good send off and obviously the, the lads give everything today and it was a tough, tough grind. Um, but no, we can keep held ahead high today. and. Um, just a bit of positivity around the club now and hopefully that can carry on to next season, whoever's here. Yeah, we'll look at the, the game as a whole, haven't we said um, a few justifications for the penalties, potential the goalkeeper could have been sent off. And, uh, oh, I'll tell you what, there was all sorts going on today, wasn't there? Well, the penalty I thought was a stone wall. Um, he's, Pusey's turned him inside out and he's brought him down. I don't know how the ref hasn't given it. Um, but obviously we went into half-time 1-0 up, uh, which is a, a good half from us. Um, Disappointed to concede in the second half. But, uh, no, we we played well. I think a lot of the lads can be positive with that today, and um, hopefully the fans can can see the positivity around the club now. And obviously, there's been a few changes, um, and that obviously for the club, and hopefully they can build on that next season. It's been a difficult time, hasn't it, from, from really from the time that you came? Yeah, it has been difficult. Um, off the field, it's been we've tried not to let it affect us too much. Um, it's hard to say whether it affected us or not. Um, we've had injuries. As We've had a lot of youngsters um, playing. The spine of the team has been built up with 17-year-olds, which is great for the future. But the present sometimes doesn't help, even though they're great lads, and I think they're going to be great players. Um, so it's been difficult. Um, um, but no, it's like there's a lot of positivity around the club. I feel, especially after the last week or so, um, and I feel um, there's, it's going to be an exciting season next year um, to, to put the disappointed one behind. Danny, congratulations on the goal. Thank you very much. Thanks for joining us. Yes, thank you.